SH Truck Bodies is a truck manufacturer for the work truck industry. SH stands for Swampy Hollow. The company started as Swampy Hollow Manufacturing when Levi Stoltzfus, the founder, started to build parts on his farm in Honeybrook, Pennsylvania. Now the business has grown to over 30 employees. SH Truck Bodies currently builds truck bodies that are distributed to distributors who will sell our products to end users. Tree removal industry, the landscape industry, junk removal industry, garbage, sanitation, different types of products that need moved. We've made capital investments to improve our product's quality, and we also have the Pennsylvania Amish craftsmanship in our products. They have a good, strong work ethic, and they take pride in their end product. So they stake their reputation on providing a good quality product that's gonna last and be durable. You will see state-of-the-art laser cutting. You will see us use material that is heavier gauge so that our bodies last longer. You will see our product being built differently and you will see a fine quality paint job that we've made a large investment in our paint facility here to ensure that our products look as good as the vehicle that they're going on. When the truck bodies leave here, we feel good about them. They have our stamp on them. We, we take pride in the way we manufacture and build them. Our customers want to have a good quality truck body that will last. They want to be able to sell a truck body that they know once they outfit a truck with that body, that they don't have to worry about it coming back for a repair or quality or a workmanship era. That's a large investment. And that investment needs to last to not only pay for itself, but also provide a profit for the end user. You might not always necessarily know where our products are going or how they're going to be used, but it makes me feel really good that whenever I see our products out there and our distributors promoting our products and helping us sell our products, it's a great feeling.